Welcome back to The Witcher. Hmm. Last time we were clearing out these discovered, undiscovered locations. We cleared out the majority of them in the Northern Territory so, of White Orchard. So we're going to finish clearing those out. We're going to start over here and make our way along the, sort, the Southern portion of the map and get back to the Nilfgaardian garrison before we continue along with the quest. No. Let's get moving on that. Let's get cracking, eh? Um. All right, let's go, Roach. Hopefully, Come don't. On, Roach. Hopefully, we won't run into any of the uh, borders again. I'm just freaking annoying as hell. I swear they do so so much, so many good things in the game. Which is just but annoying when you run into the problem with some of the things that's wrong with the game. This is just... I'd prefer they took the time to Come really on. complete the game than to hand us... Whoa there, Roach! Hand us what they assume that they could fix later on. <sighs> Let's see what's over here. Ah! Yeah. I think, yep, that's a monster nest. Alright, so... In our inventory, we do have salmon bombs. But if you notice, it's 0 out of 2. Weird little thing here is, instead of creating more salmon bombs, that's not what we do. Uh, in order to replenish those, we need to take a rest. So go over here to the meditation and just choose an hour and then go ahead and meditate. Ah, I think I'm too close to them. Okay. We're going to have to get out of range of the uh, of the enemies on the map real quick. Let's go back and take care of that. Alright, that should... No. Nope. Should have just did it where we were. Alright, let's get ahead and go back over here and meditate now. Oh, meditation. Meditate. And if you notice, the Alkahest was used in order to replenish our salmon bombs. See that? Yeah. So, we now have a restocking of salmon bombs. Our horse roach actually waited for us. Now we can go over here and deal with this nest. You can kind of tell when it's a nest because it kind of gets crowded down there. Man. So apparently we're fighting ghouls. Um, if you want to better prepare for them, you can do that. Kind of weird because... This is underbrush. This, this brush is just killing it. Making them hard to identify. It could be that in the fading light too. I'm trying to lure one over to me without one whole damn. What group. now, you piece of filth? All right, let's go. Ah, uh, come here, chicken dinner. I don't want to lure, lure all of them because even though they're level two, I'm pretty sure that's what these are. Daddy! Monster brain. Let's see if I can get lure him out. Jeez, there's a lot of them. Damn, that was wasted. <laughs> that 
That ass. Seems like you get like no experience points for doing any of this stuff. And ghoul's blood, algal bone marrow. Ooh, another gold ruby ring and a monster ball. Alright, so now we're gonna loot the rest of these corpses. It looks like there's something over here for this one. Where is it? Can't see the little highlight. There it goes. That's it. That's all we got. That's all we got. This is all we got. What's growing on this cliff? Some more wolf spain? Use all we got. Alright, let's see what else we got on this map. Alright. <clears throat> Looks like we got something over here. Yeah, I don't know what these are. Um, I haven't looked them up. Um, it's not like you have to go do these things, but they are a good experience if you do. Uh, at least anyways in the beginning. They're good for items, so why well, wouldn't you do them? Uh, but at this point I'm exploring just like you are. You know there was some damn wolves over here at some point earlier. Run, Roach. No telling if they're still here. Okay. Hmm. Looks like some deserters. Bandit camp. All right. So when you're dealing with bandits, ah, there we go. <laughs> that was the important thing trying to find freaking archer oh, hate those fuckers oh, took a head off Bandits are not really that difficult other than dealing with the archers. Um, as long as you kind of figure out where the archer is and kill him. You really don't have to worry about too much. Really not that difficult. But it's like kind of funny because... <laughs> who sets up a camp like just... It's just like sitting here right at the bridge, you know, like... He just sets that up like that. Let's see if we can get down into this valley. Um, and grab these items down here without killing ourselves. Yeah, how much I make a bet that if I fell from there, it would probably take like half my, half my life. Some of these falls, you would swear Gerard was probably like 80 years old or something like that and couldn't do crap. Doesn't make sense. Like, I got to see taking fall damage, but jeez. 
bison grass and green mold. There we go. Oh, I hate this targeting. Pull the hell up so I can grab whatever's in you. And this is what I meant about the game in general is it gets kind of annoying. Like I can't grab whatever's in there because it just won't target it for me to actually pull up the context menu for it to say, hey, loot it. Whatever. Oh well. I'll ignore it. And those probably count as like, um, they probably end up counting as like, uh, better chest is what the game calls them, I believe. So if you remember, this was the Ransack Village. There was another bandit camp over here that we got the, um, I think we got our, uh, Serpentine Still Sword, uh, diagrams from there. So let's go run through the forest to the next point over here. Uh -huh. Hey Roach, where you at Roach? Mushrooms. Let's get going over here. Keep in mind. I guarantee we're gonna run some freaking wolves. Give me up. Oh, that's nice approach. Whoa, there, Roach. Right. Looks like we have to take a long way around. Take a look on the map. Yeah, so this is pretty much a sheer drop-off cliff right here. Uh, so I guess instead of going to that one, we'll go to the bridge right here. It'll be easier to get to. Let's see if we can scare some villagers. Any of them out? No, they're not out. at the bridge. Thanks for the ride, Roach. Thanks for the ride. And of course it'll be a drop off in here. We know it. You know it. It's the smuggler's cash. Some ore and horse hide. Oh, another lesser glyph of Igni. Or horse hide. Dwarven spirits and water essence. Silver ingot. Salt. Wolf sliver and spirit. Oh, that seems like it. Well, no experience for that. Now we can make our way over here, and I suppose we could swim across the freaking river afterwards. We might run into some drowners. I'm pretty sure the one we're going to right now is another bandit camp. That should be fun fighting them at night. Not so could, fast, Roach. I wish we could pick, pick up, uh, <laughs> I guess maybe this would be too stupid, but if I could gather ingredients while I was riding Roach. I mean, I can strike off the horse. I guess go, it's a little go. too unrealistic. Yeah, 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 yeah. What is that? Definitely a bandit camp. And and are just shooting at me already. There's one hero. I I got that 
the, the archers are not really bandits. Oh damn! How do you catch me? Damn. They're really not that difficult to deal with. Even I'm playing on the second tier difficulty and I believe I'm only level three. But they're not that difficult to deal with, the bandits anyways. <laughs> I think the worst ones are the drowners actually. Alright, there it goes right there. Let's loot that lunar shards. Meteorite ore. More meteorite ore and what's in the chest? What's in the chest? Haunting, hunting gauntlets that we can't do anything about. Alchemist powder, dog tallow. We got a new diagram, broadhead bolt, and a manuscript page for Dragon's Charm or Dragon's Dream. Excuse me. Uh, okay. Let's see what these. Uh, we can take a look at them. We can. We really can. All these things are pretty good. Pretty collecting. There's nothing, nothing bad about them. There you go, Dragon's Dream. What does this do? Releases a cloud of gas that explodes when ignited. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. So we have run into some stuff that we could actually start crafting and creating whatnot um i never i did a little bit of the alchemy in the other game but i kind of just focus on sword game sword skills and so forth but we'll play around with them i'm kind of in that mood to build some stuff Ooh, meteorite ignits these things will come in handy diagram for some silk i can't remember the name of the two swords that I created so I'm trying to get back over here okay so the serpentine silver sword and the serpentine steel sword were ones that we got from uh, from the quest scavenger hunt viper school we learned about another witcher so mm. got these boats and hoes gotta have these my boats and hoes Um, yeah, quite a bit of stuff. I can't wait to trade all these orins in. Alright. Let's get back on approach. Top off. Hey ya. And let's see where we're going. Oh, why did I get back on roach? That was stupid of me. We're just going right across the river. Right there. I'm pretty sure Roach can't swim. And if our memory serves me correctly from when we came over here earlier in order to get... Um, oh! What the hell? Oh, it's... It's boiling. Oh, my God. Let's see how far Roach will make it into the water before I drown. That's it. <laughs> Not very deep at all. Alright. I'm pretty sure this is another band of camp over here. Fairly certain there's gonna be some drowners along here, but um... Oh, nope, I was wrong. Frickin' bull. These creatures are so annoying. Look at that fool trying to flank. I gotta say, I do quite, quite like the, uh, the ghoul's movements though.
this would be so much easier to deal with if you uh Come on! Finally. Oh, damn. It'd be so much easier to deal with if I probably just use my crossbow. I'm not about that life. Burn, bitch. Look at that one right up in there. He does not want to attack, but hey, they Where's the other one? There he goes. We're coming for you. I know my ghouls better still be on the floor. Yeah, there goes some group over here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. As long as I can find it. Let's see what these people are talking about more if I can't talk to them. This dude looks like he's just standing around what? like he's an idiot. Ah, he's a merchant. Let's see what he's offering. Got anything interesting? Let's see what this dude has that's supposed to be interesting. All these things in red, I can't sell him crap. Oh, because he's an herbalist. In dirt. <laughs> that solves that. Let's see what he's got, though. Um, He's got a lesser glyph of Quinn. 409 orins. Beer hides. Powdered pearl. And he's carrying manuscript page, white gull, dwarven spirit, and torn out page, grave, hag decoction, and wraith decoction, earth elemental. If these items can be found in game, I'd probably rather buy, uh, rather find them in game than actually buy them. I do a lot of, um, I do quite a bit of, uh, Searching anyway, so Farewell. it's not that important for me to buy certain things like alchemy ingredients. I just can't see a purpose in it. Go search for it yourself. All right, so we got a place of power over here, and we've got this marker right here. Let's see what that one's about. But we liberated that place for these people, and I'm pretty sure we got no closer to level <laughs> to leveling up really. So we got like another 150 points, 53 points, 153 points before we level up. Let's see what that does. We're gonna leave Roach sitting over there. It doesn't look like that far from walking inside here. Mm. I hear wolves. It's a place of power. Whoa! It's a bear. You know what we're gonna do before we go over there? I'm gonna save. <laughs> All right. Let's find out. <laughs> I can't say I've run into this before.
the big fucker. Level six bear. I guess it's conceivable that we could go past him without killing him because it looks like he's sleeping. Let's activate Quinn. I want to kill a bear. Damn. Oh. trying to mess with this dude. <laughs> nah, I'm being cautious, I don't want to die. Yeah, I know I just used one for the frickin' reason. Damn! Well, I got the bleed damage on him from my Serpentine Sword. Notice the numbers popping up over his head for this second there. Okay, he's going crazy now. Looks like we're... You don't know where I am. There you go. See that bleed damage popping off? Stress. Monster claws, monster bones. Ah. Not gonna play. We got a bestiary here. Entry. New be why did I press that? We got a new bestiary entry. Let's see what it says. Beast bears. Quinn. And beast oil. Wolves. Beast oil. I'm doing pretty good here on identifying what I'm supposed to be using. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, then when I just love that name, yeah, then I don't know why. This rolls off the tongue. All right. So now that we dealt with the bear, place of power, should we draw from place it. Of power. Ooh, is that a bear crapping or something? Tracker boots. Ability point. Happy about that. That was a Yuridan sign too. So um, Yuridan's pretty good against the race. I don't know that we're gonna be facing any anytime soon, but it's pretty good against the race. So. so now we know where there's another herbalist that, and we know we need to wake our way over here to this place of power. Definitely gonna jump on um, 
roach in order to get over there though. Hey roach. Oh, by the way, we did get some new boots. Um, the tracker boots, so we can compare those to our cavalry boots. And what do we have here? The ones we have equipped have better armor stats. And... Looks like the, the tracker boots are actually better because if you notice, there's actually a slot on them. Um, even though... Uh, a slot on them so we can equip things to them and on top of that uh, the resistance to slashing is one better so even though we're taking a hit in total armor I think the tracking boots are going to be better for us to wear we also have some hunting boots pretty similar to tracking boots we'll go with the tracking boots and see how those look oh yeah yeah I think uh, we'll go with the tracking boots. I don't have any um, anything to equip uh, to any of the slots yet. I know I could probably be doing so much more of this so much easier if I did. Like I can probably use my lesser glyph signs, all of this stuff. But I'm not. At some point, I am going to use a crossbow and chase down one of these figures just because I'm pretty sure they gotta have good meat or something like that so but as we do these less explorers we'll just we'll stick with this for now um oh I see something over there uh, it's nothing Slow now. Whoa. I'm gonna get off the horse and grab these ingredients real quick. I kind of figured we were close to the place for power anyway. Uh, you can hear it. Place of power. Should draw from it. Oh yeah, we're gonna draw from it. I wonder what's protecting it. I see nothing around, but I'm no fool. Wow, nothing's protecting me. Just got a twin sign. I'm surprised that nothing was protecting it more than anything else. All right, we're finishing up now. We got. Just a few places left to go. Uh, the next one's up here going to be by the sawmill. I already know what that is. Get Roach to come back over here. And make our way up there. Um, the next place that we're going to, I'm pretty sure, is an abandoned village with some ghouls inside of it. Run, Roach. Run like the wind, we are gonna pass some wolves. I knew it. Oh. What's this in the fields over here? Look at these wolves. Oh, y'all wanna fuck around, do y'all? Oh! Wolves want to freak around with me. Scare my horse. And wolves aren't bad ideas to kill. Like you can you can farm them for like I just kind of run past them just because. But you can farm them for uh, meat and stuff like that. And that's a good regen for you. Um, the tally. The reason why I stopped is because I saw a bunch of X markers down on the ground over here, which means something's on in the field. I want a piece of that. Looks like a bunch of dead here, so I'm 
pretty sure from the tracks that uh, at least the way they were shown about just characters fighting other characters or NPCs you know the wolves killing killing a crap ton of rabbits <laughs> well you know I'm not gonna complain they did my job for me come here roach get on this roach coach I know y'all saw that right maybe I'll zoom in for you later but you can see what happened there but that was literally the shadow of a horse in the ground is this that's it roach okay what is going on with this camp hmm I think it'd be a bad idea for us to try to steal from that camp right now Faster. Hmm. But it's interesting. Here are all the damn wolves again. Like freaking Wolf City. This mount right here. An abandoned site. Let's find out what's in here. I'm pretty sure it was ghouls because I remember kind of passing this by when one of the other places. Um, pretty sure we saw. I'm pretty sure I saw ghouls. Yep. Damn it. Treasures in the middle of this. I'm the boss. Right, dude. I think there's only one more, so let's try to go. Get some. Oh, look at that. We're restoring order to the freaking town. I guess they get to come back in here and rebuild. Yep. Look at you, Witcher. Doing stuff for free. He did that. 4D3. There's a merchant over there now. Keep going. Geralt. Thanks for everything. Geralt. We Thanks. shouldn't. We can't lose hope. Or can't lose hope. This essence. So that says something. Okay, right, so I'm gonna look at it later, anyways. Rotting flesh. Somehow I don't think I want that on my in my inventory. But whatever. There goes a chest. That's good stuff. We can check out some of the other houses too. This little shack over here. Where'd you come from? Yeah, grindstone and everything. Oh, bees. Nothing to see here. Where'd you come from? Uh, I came from your mother. Check the merchant. Show me your wares. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. So we can sell this dude everything. Apparently, he's got a 160 orange on him. So I'm not really gonna be able to sell much, but we can get rid of some stuff. That mace. 
definitely get rid of that rusty velvet sword. Basically, just trying to recoup <laughs> money from when we uh, sold all this stuff earlier, or cr crafted all this stuff earlier. Uh, I'm gonna sell those and these trousers for sure. Eh, not too bad. Cleaning up room inside the inventory. We'll keep a hold on to these right here. No, why'd you sell it? <laughs> Oops. Alright, so you can say a farewell. Farewell. Booyah! Alright, where else are we going? Look at that. We are actually almost done. A few more locations. A place of power and a guarded chest. Um, yeah. I'm gonna run over there. I feel like running. That's a good thing. I'm gonna start killing bees for the honey. There we go. I hear them wolves now. You hear them? I'll leave them alone, but if they come... Hmm. That's gotta be protected. Medallion's humming. Place of power. It's gotta be. The Wraith. If you don't see it, I use Jordan for the uh, raid. Obviously. Gained that ability point. I'm pretty sure I got quite a few <laughs> ability points. Ah, uh, damn. I think there's wolves coming my way. Yep. I'm coming out just on principle. Come on. Okay. Well, they ran away for whatever reason. I'm pretty sure it's probably a larger pack than I think it is. And then we got the last undiscovered location. And that's over here inside our... Uh, unguarded chest. So let's get on over there. Uh, again, I'm just gonna run over there. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure there's like some kind of strange mood or something like that. That was like... Whoa! <laughs> Holy crap! like I got had.
pack of them bastards, man. Wolves come, they don't mess around. <laughs> they do not mess around. But, in this case, they did not know who they were. See if we can't um, make our way over here to this ball. Hopefully, there's no. Um, uh, that doesn't look good. I'm pretty sure those are drowners. Let's see if we can get this chest without actually messing with those drowners for now. I don't really feel like messing with them, to be honest. Uh, just in case, I'm going to save. Huh. But there's a camp over here. And you can kind of hear them. There he goes. But was this like, I don't know what he is. I know I'm gonna have to kill him. the water hag. And cow water, venom extract, and water hag. So, yeah. I did that. Really? That's it. That's what you were guarding chest for. Let's save that. I'm definitely going to take out the rest of these damn uh, drowners real quick. Oh, set. That's all that I got from that. It is what it is, though. There's quite a few, um, drowners over here. Let's see what we can do about them. Oh.
The only reason why I'm trying to kill you is because they made me mad. Somebody please, pretty, pretty please, contact CD Project and tell them to fix the god dang physics on that freaking. Damn, slice them in half. Good now. So, whew. we're gonna get back on his road. There's some more drowners over there, but I'm not really interested in killing him. Um, where are you at, Roach? I'm not interested in killing them at the moment. We are now complete with the undiscovered locations. Yes, there are probably areas that you could, um, other areas that you could search for more chests in the area. There may be one or two locations here or there that you could look into for, uh, um, like bandit camps, uh, areas like that in there. But pretty much, I'm fairly certain that's at this point that's gonna be it there's there's no there's nothing else here to do um when we come back the next time we're gonna do some management of sorts and uh we'll finish up with the area and then we'll go ahead and complete the quest so that way we can get on to vizima until then guys this is the witcher signing off later